Uh, the surgical treatment depends on the location and the and the size of the fibroids. Um, and also if you're thinking about getting pregnant for the first time or again or you're done about uh, getting pregnant. If you have uh, the so-called um, submucosal fibroids or my myomas, maybe you would need a surgical procedure for that called a hysteroscopy. We talked about hysteroscopy before because that's a diagnostic tool but as I told you before, it's also a, a surgical tool for treatment. Uh, you could need to go into the into the hospital, get general anesthesia, and after that, with uh, this instrument that we put inside the cervix, and then inside the uterus, we're gonna just find out where the the fibroid is, and then just resect it with electric energy. Uh, that's a good choice for patients with heavy bleeding and also who are trying to get pregnant and have infertility problems uh, because of fibroids or who had um, recurrent miscarriage or abortions or uh, problems during pregnancy due to their fibroids. The other surgical choice is a choice called myomectomy that's a, also a surgical procedure that um, could be done by open surgery like a really big incision in your abdomen or um, through laparoscopy that is a, as I told you before small incisions one in the umbilicus and two or three more in your lower abdomen uh, the best choice the best uh, uh, possibility for treatment uh, is the uh, laparoscopic choice because you're gonna get less pain you're gonna have a shorter uh, uh, sick leave and uh, you can have get less complication chances and less additions so you're gonna be much better after the surgery and finally in the surgical options we have the hysterectomy Hysterectomy is the most common surgical procedure we do after mm, after counting the C-section. Uh, it is indicated for women who had who have uh, their childbearing is decided that they already have the kids they want to have, and that have fibroids producing a lot of symptoms. Let's say uh, bleeding, anemia, pain or bowel and bladder uh, compression symptoms. Uh, those patients could undergo a vaginal hysterectomy, that means uh, hysterectomy done through the vagina. We do a surgical procedure through the vagina and get out the, uh, the uh, uterus from there. You could undergo a abdominal hysterectomy, it's a surgery done with a big incision in the abdomen or a total laparoscopic or subtotal laparoscopic hysterectomy. That's also a procedure done through minimally invasive uh, techniques. The hysteroscopic approach and the laparoscopic approach are the best chances uh, you have because they are minimally invasive procedures where you're going to get less chances of complications. Uh, you're going to get a really good recovery. You're going to be back home probably the same day or next day after surgery. You're going to have a really short uh, work leave. Um, we just uh, want to uh, welcome you again to the doctor clinic here in Macau. We hope you uh, can just get to us and uh, seek for help. And we will probably going to give you the best chances of treatment that you have. The staff here in the Dr. Clinic in Macau, it's a worldwide uh, recognized physicians with a lot of experience, a long-term practice, 
and that could help you with your problem. So if after this video you think you can have fibroids, you have some symptoms, or you've been told that you have fibroids, just come to the clinic, ask for, a, for an appointment, and we're going to be happy to see you here. So thank you and bye-bye.